I'm going to show you how to put together your can of kit raspberry pie for starter kit. There are three heat sinks that you're going to be installing. Number one is the CPU, number two is for the RAM, and number three is for the USB controller. Now I have them lined up, number one, number two, and number three, and they have adhesive on the back, so you go ahead and pull off and do them one at a time and gently put them on. Also, when you're touching your Raspberry Pi, you do not want to touch any of the components. You want to put your fingers on the sides of the actual green motherboard itself and try not to touch the components with your bare hands. And there is also thermo glue on them so when the, uh, when the processors start to heat up it, they will settle. So don't mash it in, just kind of give it a little tap and it'll settle in as the heat goes. Next, we're going to get the Canakit Raspberry Pi 4 case and the Canakit cooling fan out and ready to go. Pull open your case and take the top part out as well as your fan and line them up and get ready to plug them in. There are no screws. It's just push it in and it compresses in how the fan should look when it's installed. And now the, you want the wind to be blowing out of the box, not into the box. So if you turn it on and you don't feel the wind coming out of the box, you need to open it back up and reposition the fan. So put your black wire on the third position on the top rung for your ground and your red wire in the first position on the bottom rung. Install the motherboard on the bottom half of the case and make sure to get them underneath the black tabs that are on one side of it. Do not force it, be gentle, and it should click when you get it in there correctly. Your port should line up. USB and network port should be lined up. And that's it, my brothers and sisters. Later.